disgusting conversation is so boring What about what? I hate her, I don't agree I did it first, I give a fuck I just won't fuck, please sleep Love, happy, can you make me happy? Hey vlog, welcome back to my channel If you're new here, I'm Anna Nicole And as you can tell by the title, today's video is a final walkthrough of this house I have been remodeling, renovating And I'm so excited to show you the before and after If you remember, this is where I started This is where I started the house hunting or house touring video, the very first one I filmed, and it looks completely different already. So I'm so excited to show you guys just the before and after. But yeah, so I'm not gonna hold you. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so here is the better look at the kitchen. I still have some outlets and everything that I need to change, but that is literally so easy, so much easier than when we started. But yeah, so here is a look at the kitchen. As you can see, I got all new cabinets, a whole new like countertop, a new kitchen, a new kitchen sink, some hardware. Um, it is a bit dusty in here because I haven't finished cleaning, but here is the um, handles that we went with with every single cabinet and it looks amazing. Also the floors, I literally love the floors. They get so dirty so easily though. So there will be so much cleaning that needs to be done. And I also replaced all of the appliances that are in the house with brand new stainless steel appliances. And I love the look of it. It is a quick wrap around of what everything is looking like. And I absolutely love it. Also in the kitchen, I got blinds for this ceiling, or for this window. I didn't get blinds for this window, but I still want to, so I'm going to come back and install that a little bit later. But also another thing I really love about the kitchen is the fact that there are these lights. I cannot remember what they're called right now, but I knew coming into this project that I wanted to get these lights in here. So there are six, so this is the brightest room in this entire house, and I love that. And then also, I'm not sure if you guys remember, but there was paneling, wood paneling in this kitchen. And also the walls were like black and red. And so yeah, I was so happy to get that replaced, get that fixed. And I just love the way it looks now. And now moving on from the kitchen, this room honestly took so much work. If you remember, I sanded and stained the floors. Also, I replaced this door. I love this door. All of the doors in the house have been replaced to look just like this. And I absolutely love it. And then also there are blinds. I also got the trims painted and I painted the walls. So it's this really pretty gray that I just really, really, really love. I also replaced this light in the house. And so there are two of these, one in the upstairs hallway, which you guys will see, and this one and they match. Then from this door, you have the very first bathroom. So this bathroom is actually my favorite in the house. Um, it took the least amount of work, first of all. I know this is dusty, dirty. I, everything has to be clean, so just ignore that but I literally love the black hardware and everything in here, the black mirror and the black um, sink faucet. If you watched my last vlog, you saw the dilemma with that one. So we got a brand new one and I actually love this one a lot more. So yeah, then you also have the vanity that I built as well as these handles right here that I put on and I just genuinely love it. And the bathroom floors match the kitchen floors which I love. Also, if you were here from the beginning, you remember the standing shower being right in the middle of the floor. So they had to shift it over, shift over the plumbing. And I got a brand new standing shower. So it is this glass standing shower. And yeah, I literally just love it so much. Also the ceilings were changed in here and in the upstairs bathroom and in the kitchen because they were like the cafeteria ceiling and I just wanted drywall. And then right off of that room is this room. You guys saw me stain and sand this floor. You also saw this ceiling fan go in and I also painted that as well. Yeah, so I really, really, really love this room. I also hung the blinds. You guys never saw me do that, but yes. I genuinely love the way this looks, love the way it came together. I love the gray. I think the gray looks actually amazing in here. Yes, so again, this is the other side and I absolutely love it, especially the stairs. So you guys saw me do the stairs. That was a whole project in itself. I really love the floors. I love how it came out. It has this dark stain on it that you guys saw me do with the white accent in the front. And honestly, I just think it came out so nice. But also I installed this handrail, which by the way, I did not want to go with. I actually really didn't like the handrail, but 
I ended up just putting it up anyway and I guess I kind of like it but I do think it looks a little too I guess rustic compared to the rest of the house and so it wasn't really my favorite but I think like a wood handrail would have looked better but we ended up going with this now for the part that you guys didn't get to see the last time you didn't get to see any updates here this is the upstairs so like I said all the doors upstairs or all the doors in the house have been replaced to look exactly the same they all have the black hardware and everything like that but also I stained the upstairs floors to match the rest of the floors and also there is the same black light that I mentioned downstairs it looks exactly the same as the one that's downstairs these are, all, are the only two that look like this in the house and then so all three bedrooms actually look pretty much the exact same so i'm going to do just a pan of all three this is the very first one don't mind this i had to take everything down but i did install new carpet in here and i also put in blinds and a new ceiling fan in every single room if you guys remember the carpet was a hassle to get in here but yes i also applied a fresh coat of paint in here and i'm just so i'm just so glad that everything in here is done in all three rooms and last but not least i feel like everyone is waiting on this part or at least i would be if i watched the series is the upstairs bathroom the upstairs bathroom if you remember started like this and it took so much work to get it to the point where it is now a point that where i am happy with it but yeah so this this bathroom took the most work out of everything in the entire house and honestly caused other problems in the house as well so i'm so glad that we caught everything got to fix everything and yeah so here is the first look at the upstairs bathroom i am so happy with it first i completely changed the hardware and the tub in this bathroom before it was like the steel cast iron tub and of course i have to switch that out also like i mentioned before all of the ceilings in the bathrooms and the kitchen were changed from the cafeteria looking ceiling to just drywall yeah so of course you guys saw me build this vanity or tiktok saw me build a vanity there's also this like just black hardware everywhere and i love the look and again all of the doors in the house were changed to like the exact same and so the bathrooms were included in that and this closet was a big project for me because this closet started out with brown wood paneling which i hated so i just went ahead and painted this white kind of like how i filled the paneling and the in other areas of the house and switched that out as well but yes i also still have to hang the blinds here so i'm not going to show what the outside looks like or where it is but yeah i literally love everything about this bathroom so much except for the fact that the floors get so dirty so quickly so i do also need to mop and sweep and all this stuff gotta love white floors but also these black floors behind me also get dirty very quickly like you can see everything on these white floors and these dark floors so that's the only thing that i don't like that i did but it's okay for now i love it and i'm so glad that it's done so yes that is actually going to conclude this video back into my favorite room in the house that's actually going to conclude this video thank you all so much for watching and thank you all so much for sticking along with me on the vlogs trying to get everything up trying to get this house re renovated and this being my very first renovation process thank you so much for sitting around and watching and yeah so that is going to complete this video if you enjoyed it please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i will see you all right back here next time with another video bye guys